Let us discuss formula for number of images formed into plane mirrors. That means if you place two plane mirrors together, then how many images will be formed? See, these two are plane mirrors placed together with some angle of inclination. With some angle of inclination. Okay, this is one mirror and this is another mirror. These two plane mirrors are placed at some angle. That is theta. The angle between the two plane mirrors is theta. Then how many images are formed here? Let us the number of images formed here is n. Then how will you find the number of images here? Consider a formula. This is n is equal to 360 degrees by theta minus 1. This is the formula for number of images formed in two plane mirrors. Here theta is the angle of inclination between two plane mirrors. Next n be the number of images formed by those mirrors. n is the number of images formed by these two mirrors. Here 360 is angle complete angle and theta is the angle between the two plane mirrors. Here what is the one? Why you subtract this one here? Is subtracted because of loss of one image due to overlapping two overlapping of images. Overlapping of two images. Thus we have to subtract one image. Here one means it is one image is subtracted from this ten. See, let us consider an example. If the angle theta is equal to 90 degrees, then how many images are formed? The number of images is equal to 360 degrees by 90. Theta is replaced by 90 degrees is minus 1. If you get cancel these things, 94 zar. That is 4 minus 1 is equal to 3. Here, the three images are formed if the angle of inclination is 90 degrees. Then, if the angle of inclination is theta is 60 degrees, then how many images are formed? 360 by 60 minus 1, 66 jar. That is equal to 6 minus 1 is equal to 5. Here, 5 images are formed. In the same way, if you, if the angle between them is, that means if theta is equal to 30 degrees, then how many images are formed? N is equal to 360 degrees by 30 minus 1. That is equal to 30 twelve zar. Okay, 12 minus 1 is equal to 11. N is equal to 11. Here 11 images are formed. So in this way we can find the number of images formed in two plane mirrors. If theta is equal to 90, three images are formed. If theta is equal to 60 degrees, five images are formed. If theta is equal to 30 degrees, 11 images are formed. So in this way we can arrange the two plane mirrors. If you get number of, if you want to get number of images, you can arrange, you can reduce the angle or you have, you have to change the angle between the two plane mirrors.